Morning YouTube, it's Charlie from Black Swamp Crew. It is a cooler, wet, nasty morning here in Ohio. All right, well it's about uh, it's about 11:30, so we're gonna we're gonna pack it up, and move it out. YouTube, it's Charlie from Black Swamp Crew. It is a cooler, wet, nasty morning here in Ohio. Drop down last last weekend was opener, and me and Joe hunted Saturday night, and I think it was like 80 degrees. I'm back in that same spot today, and it's like 50. It's been raining the past three nights, real hard. It rained real hard in drive in, so. Supposed to chill out a little today and get nice, so hopefully stuff's gonna start coming out. But yeah, on a Saturday, I think Joe showed you in the last in the opener video. We were hunting that field, and there was a cornfield across from where we were hunting us. We were watching, but we saw them beds when we were walking in. So I'm gonna go hunt the other side of that field and sit there today, and hopefully see something around all them beds. But We'll uh, get back to you soon. All right, I just got to the spot I want to sit at. Got set up. Just creeping into legal shooting light now. And I don't see nothing yet, but I see that bedding area that we were talking about. I'm sitting across the field facing the tree that Joe was sitting next to on Saturday. Hey guys, uh, sat for about three hours, a little over three hours, and as you can see now, it's raining pretty hard. Uh, it was pretty clear for probably the first hour, didn't see nothing, but uh, yeah, it was on and off rain pretty much the whole time. I was post up against a tree back down there and uh, basically watching here that big tree is behind me over my shoulder watching to the side of that that's over by where Joe was sitting last Saturday it's kind of where all the beds were but didn't see nothing it's been raining for like three days straight here and it's supposed to clear up today but it doesn't seem like it yet so Let's sit in the truck for a while, maybe see if it cools off, and uh, maybe go try a different spot. Yeah. Old toad. Hey, buddy. I gotta make sure I get a lot of good B-roll for Justin, since I don't see deer. back to the truck pretty good walk in there but yeah sit see if the rain stops in a little bit and maybe try a different spot all right well uh fellow crew member dj laying the hammer down on this big old public land new jersey swamp donkey you're allowed to bait new jersey so uh he had signal 11 lures uh the sweet corn the the beads and the spray around his stand he had uh, lots of pictures of this deer, a little bit of history of it from last year. He missed it last year, actually leaving a scar on it. Those pictures are uh, on our page. Check out Black Swamp Crew for more pictures of this deer. And head on over to Signal11Lures.com to get you some of that sweet stuff. Uh 
All right, well, it's uh, Friday, October 2nd, and uh, I'm underdressed. It's freezing. It's like 40 degrees, but uh, kind of a fiasco this morning. I got here about 5.45, and uh, I only had one boot. I had to drive back home and get my other boot. I don't live far, which was nice, but started off like a jungle on the way back off the main road over here it goes public main road private and then you drive around and there's more public over here which is where I'm at now but probably about a mile from where I'm at coming back from getting my boot looked like a pretty good buck he was like right on the side of the road like he had just crossed from the public going to the private and uh, obviously I'm not gonna shoot that deer probably unless I got a lucky hair on my dick, but uh, it just means they're moving today, it's cold, this cold front just hit Ohio, October 2nd, 40 degrees, that's, that's pretty good, and uh, I haven't seen any deer this morning, it's like 9.30 right now, I'm starting to see a lot of cars driving up, I'll show you my spot in a second, I'm overlooking, I'm probably about probably about 500 400 yards from a, a big bean field up here but I'm back here in like this brushy overgrown field kind of up on a hill overlooking that bean field and I didn't even see nothing this morning but it was also very foggy out so it is what it is I don't know but uh yeah we're freezing we're having fun but, uh, I just seen a car pull up that was squirrel hunting opening day opening day of deer season you go squirrel hunting but uh yeah so I think that's about to happen over here so we'll see we'll sit tight until some 22 start rocking and then we'll get out of here but um yeah stay tuned all right well this is my spot those are the beans down there and kind of wrap around a little bit and then go way back that way that tree line's kind of the the entrance road here so I can kind of see all the cars coming in see who's here um, basically just kind of like an overwatch today seeing what's going on I've been watching the deer come from the woods behind me and funneling into this bean field at night so I figured in the morning they'd be coming back this way I got the wind in my face but I didn't even see a deer this morning and I still got here pretty early after that boot fiasco but um I got here at about 6.15ish, which legal shooting light wasn't until 7. Wasn't as early as I wanted to be, but I have good wind and the grass is wet, so it was pretty quiet. And it's a full moon. I didn't even need my light, so I think I snuck in here pretty good. But, yeah, we're just going to keep watching, uh, see what's going on, see if we can't see something. We're trying to sit till. Probably about noonish, but uh, yeah, stay tuned. All right, well, uh, this is the woods that I've been seeing the deer come from, and uh, this is the bean field I hunted over. I expected them to be coming to me, and uh, this is what I sat up against. I was over there next to that bush, but I mean, if you look, there's deer beds all in here. You know, it's made it down. This is, that's where I sat, right there, tucked up into this bush here. So, uh, deer in here, and it overlooks the entrance road, so they can see anybody coming in. They just boogie on out of here, and uh, you'll never even know that you, that you missed them. Pretty good spot. All right, well, it's about uh, 11.30. And uh, we're about to pack it up and get out of here. Wife's got a doctor's appointment we got to get to and uh, didn't see nothing anyways. But uh, we're having fun. I'll get in the woods again when I can. So uh, like, subscribe, stay tuned, and uh, I'll see you in the woods.